I'm now going to run through the paging zone selection process. Uh, this is something that happens all the time uh, in all venues at all times. So I've zoomed in now on the main screen but just to remind you the paging buttons are over here. At the moment we can see that we've only really got one paging button selected which says dressing rooms which is this one here. Next to it you can see that we have an all rear of house. The buttons are a bit flaky. One of the reasons that we have to replace this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a couple of more zones there and uh, show you how we go through that process. If I hit configuration and bring up the paging buttons page, I can now see this this area uh, this page. Let's move in a bit closer. So, up the top here, we see the zone group button. So that lets us select which of these eight buttons I'm going to change. Down on this side here, I see the zone selection list. So these are the zones that are available to me on this console. Now these permissions are set by the technicians elsewhere in the building. And over here I have the selected zones that are selected when I press that button. And lastly, I have the ability to change the label. So I'm going to move to button number three now, which is this third button over on the left. And I'm going to put in the playhouse foyer, the green room di dining, and green room lounge. And I'm going to call that button public. I hit done. And if I now pan back to the buttons, you can see that that third button here is now called public. That's happened on the fly, and if I were to make a page now, it would go to those areas.